Good evening, Zero K fans. This is Shadow Fifty Three welcoming you to another exhibition match. It's time between Xavier and Saktoth on Icy Run. Now, Icy Run is a very small map, as should be very obvious. It's not a map that, well, not a map that you see a lot of one v one. Unsurprisingly, I see a lot of games in the replay list listed for massive team games. I'm really not sure why. And we both Severe and Saktoth very quickly going towards the center of the map. Saktoth starting out with a vehicle factory, and Savier starting out with a shield factory. Shieldbot factory is probably going to be much better off a light vehicle factory on this map. While it is a flat map, and therefore does allow for vehicles to get around pretty quickly, it also has only a few paths, and isn't really big enough for that advantage to pay off. Also, I've actually seen spiders used a decent effect in here, given the hills in the center. All these hills around here are actually very good for spiders, and even Floki and shield bots can take some advantage of them, but spiders are the easiest time. However, vehicles have... they can't do anything with that. They are entirely forced around those hills, so that limits them further. Not entirely sure why Sackdoth is doing that, but Sabir going for three bandits going forward, going to the commander. The commander should be okay for this. He is being upgraded earlier. It is being upgraded early while Sabir sets up his early economy. Both players saying early economy. Three bandits coming in here, and Sackdoth Doing what he can, gamer. One of the bandits, and the other two bandits killing his commander very quickly. How in the world is that happening? Three bandits take out Saktoth's commander. That was that was fast, and Saktoth. Well, he kind of has very few resources in the bank and no resource income coming in. So I think that's the game. Hope you enjoyed that, everyone, and we'll have a much longer game after this. As soon as. Well, Sackcloth may actually keep going. I'm not entirely sure. Let's see. He is sending a slasher over, and he does have another slasher in production. Sorry, another mason in production, so he actually could rebuild him here. It's not quite over yet. But it is still looking pretty bad. Wait, right, Sackcloth doing what he can, pushing forward. I think actually at this point he might be able to rebuild if he goes for it. I mean, he doesn't have as much build power as Sabir, but at the same time, if he... Well, he probably need more metal extractors than anything. Oh, wait, there's a bandit coming in here to harass this, and yeah, that's that's going to be it. There's no defenses here. Bandit taking out everything he can from the factory and can take out the metal extractor with impunity, which means Sackdoth now has zero metal income. Now that's the game. Yep, Sackdoth, all the stuff's on self-destruct, and down it goes. So, hope you enjoyed that. Very quick game. Be back shortly with another one that's, you know, an actual decent size. So stay tuned.